Hey, what's going on guys? You've been hunted here and welcome back to Lonely Craft. Now it's been a while and um, I'm actually in a little bit of a slump right now as far as ideas go. Uh, and I also don't have a lot of time because I've been extremely busy the last few days. So as you can tell by the title, I decided what better way to come back after not playing this for a week or two than uh, to do a tour to catch everyone up and especially for all the new subscribers and uh, just let you guys see what's going on here. So it's almost nighttime. Um, I don't know if that's going to be a good thing or a bad thing. It might make it look cooler. We don't know. Uh, but if we turn around here, you'll see our whole world, and this is going to be a little tour. So uh, this is our little boat dock here, first of all. Uh, not finished, as you can see. The roof is pretty screwed up and ugly. Uh, but we do have a kingdom situation here going on. And if you guys haven't been watching, what's going on is we just have this outer wall to protect us from all the bad and evil things outside. And then uh, everything is on the inside of that, and then there's some other stuff, too, that we'll, we'll check out here as we go. So uh, I did not mean to fall all the way down in, but it's whatever, and I didn't mean to do that either. I'm screwing up big time here. So uh, this is also just for anyone you know that watches you know everything that we've done since the beginning. Uh, this is actually the longest I've ever played Minecraft on a series, so I'm pretty proud of myself for that. Uh, but as you can see, we got some pretty good design here. Uh, pretty 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 cool-looking design um, on the outside. This is only on the front. The... Uh, the far side is just nothing, it's just flat. Uh, but over here, we have our button to get in, to get in through our mechanical door, uh, because we can't just have people getting in. And then uh, on, the, on the inside, since it doesn't really matter if something walks on it, you just hit the pressure plate, opens the door, and uh, that's how you get in and out of here. And then I also use some stairs uh, on the top to, so we can have a little window, like, oh yeah, there's nothing bad outside, it's good to go. Uh, so we have some open real estate still, we haven't built everything yet. Uh, in the front two corners, not on the back corners, because it was kind of a pain to make, and everything, this is survival mode for those of you that don't know. Uh, we have two towers here, this is just to look out. Um, identical towers on both sides with the door right here, so that we can get up onto the wall. And then over here, we have our main building, which is our, our house. Really nothing in here except a bed. Uh, no other point to it yet. Uh, we have a to-do list, which we haven't uh, gotten to yet because I haven't been playing. Uh, but that's the house. It's raised off the ground. Just so we get this little step-up area. Uh, we have our pig farm, which is a lot of pigs, and that zombie is dancing. Uh, this is our crops, which look like they're completely fully uh, grown. Over here, if you, like I said, if you haven't been watching and you don't know what this is, but we use this a lot, is our enchantment room. As you can see, we have two enchanted swords on us, actually. Um, we just kick this guy's ass real quick. Oh, he, he doesn't even want it. He wants to run away. Uh, but in here, I actually changed the design recently. So we have some nether brick here uh, with some glowstone behind it to make it look cool. Uh, change in the wood. Uh, we have some water bottles and things that we need. Our vial brewing stand, our cauldron, anvil, crafting test, you know, all the books and things. And uh, all that good stuff. Ooh, they actually dropped the chain mail. I actually forgot about that. Oh, man, there's a lot of zombies here. Okay, so this is probably the most important thing and one of the first things we ever did. Uh, this is the storage room, and as you can see, we have it first level, second level, and uh, all the main important stuff is really on the first level. So if we come down here, we have our tools and weapons, which I actually need to put these back. And I have to be completely organized for you guys that haven't watched yet. Um, that's like one of the most important things for me, is organization. Let me just... Oh man, hold on. We got some uninvited guests. Okay, apparently I need to put a little bit more light in here. Usually when it's nighttime, I go to sleep. So let me just put this armor in here. No real spot for armor. And then rotten flesh. Okay, so here we have just our wooden and wooden crafted items, basically just all that stuff and uh, some different crafted things. Uh, dirt and cobblestone. All this dirt is because we're at, we were actually on the side of like a hill and uh, we cut it out. All our food. We have a lot of raw beef. Um, all of our mining materials. And then these chests down here are pretty much empty. Um, we did have some furnaces here and we actually do have some furnaces still. I didn't realize that I still had those here. I need to remove those. Uh, this is all the cosmetics, and this is nothing in these chests, like I said. Uh, but we, I decided that, you know, since we have a storage area, we should have an area just for a furnace. So, as you can see, everything is uh, just brick, stone brick walkways, because it looks nice. And uh, if you come up here, we actually have a giant furnace. And this, uh, this is what I did in the last episode. Giant furnace made out of wool. And if you come in here, we have... Some, uh, I was testing out the lava, because we have a lava pit, a giant chandelier... And then in here, we just have some coal and, so, and a bucket and things like that. 
so that's our giant furnace room and then uh, over here we have our portal that was built into uh, the tree obviously doctored up a little bit the tree didn't grow like that Ooh, we got an enderman over there messing with our pigs and this is actually one of the first things I ever did this is our strip mine and our strip mine is super important uh, it was super important I've pretty much ruined it since now because I've used it uh, but if you go all the way down it's just a normal strip mine you know you come all the way down uh, we actually ran into a mine shaft down here and there's a lot of mine shafts as you can see that way and that way uh, but there's three floors right here and they're all on diamond level because the main point of this was to find diamond actually sounds like there's some yeah I hate these little guys these little guys are the most annoying sons of bitches in the world uh, totally a mistake on my part but as you can see we have all this stuff here we have some obsidian down there where there was some lava uh, that's basically all there is on this floor and then when you go down to the middle floor, which is where all the other stuff is, we have some other materials, which I always forget is here. Uh, a lot of redstone and cobblestone and stuff like that. Uh, we actually have a spawner back there. And that's really all that there is. Uh, I've probably found, I don't know, 30 or 40 diamonds in this strip mine. So it was a pretty successful strip mine. Uh, if, I, if I were to make another one, I'd probably choose a completely new uh, location just because I feel like I'm pushing my luck with it. But uh, this strip mine is basically the last thing I have to show you. And then this spawner. So uh, other than that, I just want to say thank you guys for watching the video. Hopefully you guys enjoy the Lonely Craft series. Hopefully I can get back and uh, start making some more videos about it pretty soon here. And if you have never watched it, hopefully this uh, got you wanting to watch it. So as you can see, that's our spawner. Um, definitely need to make it better. Not a very good spawner. Just kind of threw it together in a few minutes. But uh, other than that, that was it. Thanks for watching, guys. Like I said, leave a like if you enjoyed. Maybe leave a comment if you have any ideas on what to build. Because like I said, I'm running out of ideas. And uh, hopefully you guys will check it out. I'll leave the playlist on the description and in the, in the, uh, on the screen. And uh, you guys can check out those other videos. So, see you guys. Thanks for checking out the video. Be sure to check out the video showcase of the day. Subscribe in the top right corner if you haven't yet. And follow me on Twitter. The link's in the description below.